You've probably noticed, Hytale's combat is something different. I don't even know where to start with this. So far, Hytale just keeps getting more and more epic with everything that is revealed. The second trailer showed us so many things that we could expect, but are subject to change. But overall, it's a beautiful game, as far as we've seen. Even the combat is next gen, but it deserves its own explanation. Welcome guys, please consider subscribing as only a small percentage of people that watch my videos are actually subscribed. Let's get straight to the point. <laughs> First and foremost, ignore all the precious combat clips you've seen in the past year because Hypixel is completely rebuilding the approach of combat in Hytale, and this new combat system is not Minecraft combat. Spam clicking is not the dominating gaming skill any longer. The motto of Hytale combat is, you are what you wield. Your weapon determines how you fight, who you can fight, and your mastery of that weapon determines if you're gonna win a fight. You can kill a full diamond with a wooden sword if you have the right skill. On top of that, depending upon the weapon in your hand, you also get to do special abilities as well. That's cool. Pretty much your entire fight depends upon the weapon you carry. If you carry a dagger, you're fast, but less dangerous. If you carry a warhammer, you're dangerous, but really slow. Although not a lot of things about the Hytale combat have been revealed yet, this new combat system will completely change PvP and gaming. This combat initiative is being taken by people who have already grown tired of games that have crappy combat mechanics. So they're for sure gonna do something groundbreaking with Hytale's combat, or at least they're aiming to. The way you block also has its own story. You can block with a shield, but if you have a dagger, you don't block, you dash to evade. So a fight between a heavily armored soldier with a warhammer versus a light clothed dagger wielding assassin is likely to end in favor of the dagger wielder. Just not in this clip. Not to mention the AI. The bots in the game are pretty much the same as players. Hytale devs say that the AI mimics an actual player to a great extent, which is really useful for PvP lovers who have no friends. But the devs said something that made me question Hytale's intentions on making AI that may turn self-aware leading to human extinction. The combat system is so polished toward the most minor details. If you're going head-to-head -head with someone, you need to take care of your stamina, your mobility, how many times and which pattern you attack. Otherwise, you're gonna waste your energy ultimately reducing your chances of winning or even fleeing from the battlefield. The special abilities, or signature moves, are also a prominent feature of every weapon you wield. Your weapon's signature move can completely turn the tide of battle, if used the right way at the right time. The blog post suggests that your signature move is charged by damaging and blocking. If you carry a sword and shield, you charge your signature ability by shield blocking and damaging your enemy. So with good situational awareness and stamina management, a Hytale player might just emerge as the Technoblade of Hytale. <laughs> there are many other things related to combat to talk about. Trinkets that give you perks in combat and other areas of the game as well. Magic combat has yet to have a full explanation. But nonetheless, Hytale's combat system is truly a good one and the approach they're taking with it is fairly distinct. Every weapon will feel different, be used different, and give different advantages in situations coupled with their own disadvantages. This fluid combat system is much to offer and I want to hear what you think about it. Thank you for watching this video, people of Orbis, and I'll see you later. Sorry for the long wait for my next video. Uh, general life is not very kind to a YouTuber. Thank you.